Hello and welcome to yet another YouTube video here on this channel. Today we are inside of Superlists, which is a new to-do list application made by the same team that made Wonderlist, which is now acquired by Microsoft and is Microsoft to do. And this app looks really fun and interesting. The first thing is that it has an inbox, which is something I look for in every app I use because when we are quick capturing stuff, we want them to have a place to go before we organize them. So if you have an inbox, you don't need to organize and it will be easier to capture things. So let's take out the trash. That's my go-to to do for this YouTube videos. And once you have done that, you can add a due date, you can add a label to it. So it could be personal stuff, it could be for my YouTube channel, it could be for work. And I could choose which one of these I want to add, so it will be easier to find them later. Uh, it has a small sidebar here where you can have messages with your team. You have a today view where you can see your tasks for today and you have the different lists here and you can go on and make new lists. Let's remove this and let's give this a name. Let's say this was YouTube video ideas like that. Uh, and it is a little bit buggy in the web version. Let's try again YouTube video ideas. But it is a fairly new app, uh, so we can have lists here and I can go on and add things to my lists and I can drag them and move them to somewhere else. Uh, so that's a really fun feature, the fact that you can just easily drag them. I know that it looks really, really simple, uh, but it is a great feature that they have inside of the app. As I said, the web version is a little bit uh, buggy, but you can create, as I said, lists and you can also create sections. So let's create a section. That's what I actually did the last time I pressed the wrong button. So let's say YouTube videos and I can add these into a section right here. And I could add one called personal stuff. Uh, stuff and this could have my grocery lists inside of it so groceries I think I spelled that correctly uh, and you can easily just drag this into your personal stuff so it is a beautiful simple note-taking app and it also has collaborations real-time collaboration which is really good uh, that's not something other apps actually do have. Let's jump into my watch uh, to be watched. I could make this into a paragraph and I could start writing here if I wanted to instead of having it as a to do. I could have it as a bulleted list, but right now it is a task. I could add images or even uh, attachments to this, or I could jump in here and I could start writing. Uh, so let's say I wanted to take a note with this, I could do that and take notes inside of here, or I could leave a message in here as well for the rest of my team. So it has some note-taking cap capabilities as well. I don't like to-do list apps being a note-taking app, but I understand why it is possible and how, in which use cases this would be used. Uh, but overall, it is a really beautiful looking uh, to-do list app, which I like a lot. The ability to add simple notes to your different tasks is a great feature and just in general an app I like a lot and I'm excited to see develop, especially for smaller teams. If you have a smaller team or you're working with someone or even uh, if your girlfriend or boyfriend or wh whoever it is uh, living with you, if you wanted to share the grocery lists and just share things about the house, to-dos around the house, this app is really great. And it has, as I said, real-time collaboration, which is 
amazing. Uh, so that's super list for you. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them down below and I will try to get to them as soon as I can. Thank you so, so much for watching today's video.